nervous. <laughs> <laughs> Not looking. <laughs> oh my goodness. The thing with this challenge is I kind of feel like once you commit it, an idea, there's not really any going back. We've got slightly distracted, we're now in a twitch shop. Let's start off by pulling his head off. Wow. Oh, we got All right, okay. let's go. Oh. oh. Hello everybody, hope you're all well. Welcome back to my channel. I'm back today with a really exciting collaboration. This one's with Hermione Chantel, who I know many of you know already. We're going to jump straight into the vlog footage from our challenge now, where essentially, we had five pounds each to spend in store in Poundland to buy items for each other to upcycle, transform, and see how we get on with them. So let's jump into the footage where we met up in London and went shopping. Hi. This is Hermione, who I'm sure you know already, but just in case you don't, what do you do, Hermione? I do DIYs, home renovation, etc. So today we've got a really exciting challenge. It's a Poundland challenge. We did a Poundland video back in Christmas time, wasn't Christmas, it? Yeah. yeah. Where we um, made some Christmas decorations with Poundland items. So today we've had five pounds each to spend in Poundland to pick out items for each other to do a little DIY or upcycle on. So we've made it to Poundland. Hey. We are at the one in Camden town in London. It looks very small. It does look quite small, which would make it more of a challenge. Yes, it could be fun. Yeah, so five items each. And a glass of wine, <laughs> and we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Yeah. One or two wildcard items. We're and then some nice ones. Yeah. Yeah, we got this. All right, okay, let's okay. go. <laughs> Mine is off. <laughs> Is well stocked. I've come into kind of like the outdoor gardeny bit. I think I'm gonna find something in this area first. I'm not looking. <laughs> Yes. I'm all done. That is a big bag. <laughs> it's I'm a big nervous. bag. I bought a few extra bits in there to be honest. I've got a couple of snacks. I was about to get yeah. a mug, but I didn't. You need some DIY snacks at all times. Good idea. Just for those emergencies, which we might be facing at this rate. I'm nervous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited and yeah. nervous. Right, we'll go and have a look at what we got each other. What we got, yeah. yeah. We got slightly distracted, we're now in a thrift shop. <laughs> if you'd like to see us do this challenge but with thrifted items, do let us know in the comments. Do, that would be fun. That would be fun. Okay, so it's time for me to see what Hermione got. Drum roll, please. <laughs> I'm very excited, slightly nervous because everything that I will be unwrapping now, essentially, I've got to DIY. And regardless of how bad it is. Okay. And there is one wild card item. Okay, I've seen these in <laughs> store a lot. I love them. I haven't bought them before because I haven't thought of something to do with them. So I'm gonna have to Sorry. rack my brains. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I think I've got something in mind for this okay, actually. Okay, okay, yeah. good. We Were you definitely... expecting something like that? No, oh, no, that's okay. very fancy. Um, Finding I don't break it, we'll be good. Fingers <laughs> I'm gonna off. put it down gently now. <laughs> oh my goodness. I couldn't find the square ones, I'm so sorry. I thought it was a bath mat, but this is the pedestal mat. This is the one that goes around the loo, even better. It looks okay. a bit like a furry handbag. It does, doesn't it? What do we think? Could that be a look? <laughs> <laughs> or a bib. Yeah. I'll pop that on when I do the DIYs. Oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> this is the wild card I Okay. Think. I don't actually know what that is. Oh, you Is it a toy? Yeah, you throw it in the sea. I so think. this is a dart ball. Absolutely no idea what I'm going to make with that. Oopsie daisy corner protectors. Corner protectors. Oh, wow. Plastic things that go on the corner of furniture to stop kids bumping their heads. Yeah. With it. They're okay. in the baby section and I thought they could be quite fun. They've got cute little faces on. I'm going to have to definitely use my imagination with yeah. these, but I'm trying to come up with something. Paint glitter. I thought that one was quite fun. Amazing. I thought you saw me buy that no, one. No, I didn't and I didn't see this in store either. So this is glitter that you add to paint. Okay. Do Things like are going to get messy. Yeah. <laughs> it says it adds a delicate sparkle to paint and wood varnish. Delicate sparkle. I thought that oh, one was right. quite quite a good one actually. I'm quite That's proud really of myself. That's really cool. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm very excited. Well, good luck. 
same to you. <laughs> we'll and see how it goes. See how it goes. So I've got my five items. Pause the video and let me know in the comments down below what you would do with these five items. I want to hear your ideas before I get cracking with mine. So we've got the loo mat, this nice and fluffy loo mat. We've got these corner protectors, this paint glitter. We've got this dart ball and this candle holder. Let's get some painting done. I think I'm going to keep these three out and pop these two to one side. Okay, so I'm going to start off by adding some gold furniture paint and I'm going to pop that into this old yogurt container and let's add in some of the paint glitter. Wow. Oh, that looks so cool. I have a feeling that this stuff can get everywhere. I think Hermione set me up with this one for a messy task. Let's give that a good stir. Wow, this is full on. And now what I'm going to do is use the glitter paint to go all over the candlestick. As you can see, it's giving it a nice texture. And what I have here is one of these sandwich tins that came from Poundland. I've actually already sprayed it copper from a previous DIY. I'm going to upcycle it again. So I'm gonna go ahead and start painting this as well. The first layer has dried. So I'm gonna go on with some hot glue. Now we're just going to paint all of the top. I am liking the texture that the glitter gives to the paint. Giving it kind of like a sandy finish, which I think looks really good. And there we go. And to finish it, I'm just placing it onto this wooden board. I'm going to add some autumn foliage that I picked up in Poundland and a candle. Do be careful with any naked flames. Never leave them unattended. And you can always use an LED light to be on the safe side. Okay, so on to this guy. Glitter is still getting everywhere. Let's start off by pulling his head off. I like the shape of this and I'm feeling a little pumpkin coming on. I'm just wrapping a piece of wire around it just to try and give it a little bit more shape. Okay, now let's wrap all of these together. So now we've got something that's slightly more pumpkin shaped. And next I'm just going to coat it in some glue. I'm just using this decoupage glue, but you could use, I think PVA glue would probably be perfect for this actually. And then once some glue is on it, and add some pieces of tissue. I'm just gonna pop that to one side to dry now. I'm gonna try to turn this into a pumpkin as well. Yes, I probably have lost the plot now. Let's just go with it and see what happens. So I've got one of these sponges. I think this came from Poundland as well. I'm gonna use this just to stuff inside. So let's place this in the middle. Then I'm going to remove these bits. They might come in handy actually. And this is the bit where I'm praying that this isn't going to just look like a ball of fluff. And I'm just gonna tie some wool around. I've seen loads of people on YouTube doing these and they are so cool. I think they always look brilliant. I'm not sure mine's going to. <laughs> The thing with this challenge is I kind of feel like once you've committed to an idea, there's not really any going back. I don't know, I kind of like the texture. And then what I thought we would do with this bit is use it as the stalk. Let's cut it at a diagonal and we'll just stick that on the top. Ta-da! <laughs> and I'm just gonna glue a stalk onto this one. And that's all dried and I'm really pleased with how that's turned out. So now I'm just going to give it a coat with this chalky finish furniture paint in antique white. Uh, 
And as that's dry, I'm just taking a black pencil and I'm just going to go over where I think the lines should be, just to give it a little bit of detail. Next up, I'm going to take these Oopsie Daisy corner protectors. So the idea I've got is to actually add these onto the corner of a photo frame. I've actually got a frame that I already had here from Poundlands, like that, on each corner, just to give it a bit of something. So let's paint these and let's paint the frame. I'm gonna go on with some copper paint. Okay, I don't think the paint's going to stick to this because it is like rubber. So I'm going to wipe all that off and then I'm going to take them outside and give them a quick blast with some primer. There we go. They actually look really good grey, don't they? But um, I think we're going to still go with the copper effect. Okay, so these have all dried, so we're going to glue our little mates onto the corners now. all another coat of the copper paint. I'm hoping this is going to stick. Yeah, that's better. Okay, remember the sponge we just saw? Well, that kind of reminds me of an autumn leaf. So I think what I'm going to do is just chop it like that. And let's make a stalk on it. Is that a thing? There we go. And I think we could even maybe score out some lines in it like that. And let's take some acrylic paint in autumn colours and we'll do some printing. Here goes nothing. Let me know which one of those is your favourite and let me know how you thought I got on. And do pop over to Hermione's channel now where Hermione is doing her five over there. I hope they're gonna go okay. <laughs> I really hope you enjoyed this video. I can't wait to see how Hermione's got on with her five items that I picked out for her. So exciting. If you've come over from Hermione's channel, welcome. It's great to have you here. I'm posting new videos every single week, so do click subscribe. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye. For today's video, we've got a really exciting challenge. It's an advertisement, don't worry. <laughs> out takes me long in the video. <laughs> right, okay. Oh, oh, oh. So this is paint. No. <laughs> so this, <laughs> this glitter paint. Sorry, I've said that twice now. Okay, I'm in the Ooh, back to school stationery. Loads of fabulous videos. So I'll link Hermione's channel. Oh, hello. 